Hi guys, we are the Brand New Sports Battle Team. I am Happy 8K, I'm Simbo, I'm Hansas. And today we have a big package from Asus RG. So we have the headset and the headset stand. And we have the keyboard and of course the mouse. So first guys, you unbox the ROG Gladius D wireless the mouse. So I don't have any lamanedo. So we have a mouse, a cable. Meron tayong um, tweezers saka para pang replace din ang switch ng mouse. Um, dito rin yung um, USB dongle para sa um, wireless. Tapos meron din tayong mga replacement skates dito saka manual. Um, based sa mouse, um, gusto ko yung shape niya kasi malaki yung kamay ko. So medyo malaki yung size ng mouse tapos yung bigat niya sakto lang din. So feeling ko um, sobrang makakabulo ko sa paglaro ko kasi sobrang importante yung shape ng mouse. Kasi um, muscle memory din kasi kapag naglalaro ka, so ayun, para sa akin, um, malaking factor din siya. So, ang maganda rin dito sa mouse ito is replaceable yung mga switches niya sa mouse 1 and mouse 2. So, para naging effective yun, um, kapag kunyari nasira yung mouse 1 mo or yung mouse 2 mo, syempre, kailangan mo ipadala sa tagaay sa mouse ganun. Pero, since napakadali niya palitan, pwede mo siya gawin na sarili mo, gamitin mo lang itong tweezers, tapos ilalagay mo lang din itong switch mismo. So, magiging good as new din siya. So, parang um, matagal din talaga siya sa'yo. So, for a wireless mouse, 89 grams na yung, ano, yung bigat niya. So, para sa akin, uh, as a pro player, nagdala ng FPS game, sobrang mahalaga yun. Tapos, talagang ramdam mo yung difference niya compared sa um, mouse na mas mabigat. So, mas madali ka makakapag-adjust ng tutok mo, mas makakapag-flick ka ng maayos na hindi ka nabibigatan. So, ayan. Ayan yung isa sa mga gusto mong features ng mouse ito. So, ang ROG Gladius 3 mouse ay may tri-mode connectivity which is pwede kang gumamit ng wireless or pwede kang mag-wire. Tapos sa may wireless, meron kang dalawang options para gumamit ng Bluetooth or pwede kang connect through the wireless dongle. Tapos, pwede ka rin gumamit ng USB A to C na cable in case kanyara nalupat na yung mouse mo, pwede mo pa rin siya gamitin. So, ang optical sensor ng mouse na ito ay meron 19,000 dpi at pwede pa umabot hanggang 26,000 dpi. Pero para sa akin, usually ginagamit ko lang naman 800 dpi. Pero minsan binabago ko siya kapag nagbabrowse ako or nanonood lang ako ng mga videos sa internet. Pero ayun, meron kong option para umabot sa ganun kataas na dpi. Ang maganda rin dito sa ROG Gladius 3 is meron din siyang Aura Sync. So sa Aura Sync is kapag kunyari yung mga kulay ng mga mouse, keyboard at headset mo, pwede mo siya ipagpare-parehas. Mapag-sync mo lang yung devices mo para parehas sila ng ginagamit na um, light na design or parang motion niya ganun para pareha sila. So, ayan box natin yung RJ Speakscope RX. So, meron tayong dalawang speaker. Meron siyang user manual course. Hindi ko yung actual product na ito. So, sobrang bagay ko sa akin kasi may hindi ko sa full size keyboard and yung base niya is aluminum metal and ang sarap sa feeling ng piece niya. So, dito sa ilalim, may ita natin. Meron tayong USB to pass through and sobrang useful na ito sa akin kasi lagi kong hawak yung phone ko pa naglalaro. Eh. Pwede ko siya i-charge dito and mag-save siya as extra USB slot. So, dito sa F12 key natin, meron siyang stealth key and yung purpose niya is kunwari sobrang dami natin nakabukas na application or file sa computer natin. Pag pinilot natin yung stealth key, Lahat yan, mamiminimize saan. So, ano nga, after ko maglaro or after ko gumawa ng schoolwork, sobrang dami ko nakabukas ng browser or files. Pag magte-take a break na ako, pag pinot ko to, direct na ako sa desktop ko. So, aras na itong keyboard natin kasi meron siyang quirky lighting. So, ang switches natin is ROG RX Optical Mechanical Switches and meron siyang 1ms response time. So, ang keyboard ko ngayon is red switch and available din sa blue switch which is clicky, so... Ayun. So, this is the ROG metal stand where you can put your headset. So, this is the top part of the stand where you put the headset and this will be the base. Which will be the main support. So, you put the screw under and then twist it. And then, you're good. You have your ROG metal stand. So now let's open the RG Fusion 2 300. Uh, you open it from the bottom. And so on the 
box, we have the main headset, and in here are the extra pads for the headset itself, the USB dongle, and of course the manual. So for the ROG headset, uh, I find it very comfortable and I could wear it for a few hours while I'm playing. And so for the features, it actually has an internal microphone, so you don't need to pull out anything. So it's inside the headset itself. It has a 7.1 virtual surround sound. It has a 50mm Asus Essence drivers. So this headset has the high-res ESS 9280 quad back. So what this does is it enhances the sound of the headset. And this is very good for me since I need proper sound in gaming and I like to watch movies. So I'm gonna try the voice recording of the headset. Hello, this is the ROG Fusion 2 300. Hello, this is the ROG Fusion 2 300. So for the sound quality of this, it's actually very nice since it's clear and I can be using it while playing Valorant so I can hear my, the comms of my teammate better. Thank, Thank you, you Asus ROG for this wonderful package. package.